In addition to my sugar beet troughs, we have uh, potatoes, okay. about two acres of potatoes over there. Okay. Um, primarily, I'm looking at foliar, fungus, foliar diseases like early blight. Oh. Are you familiar with early so, blight? So, so you're, you're, you're interested in just the um, uh, disease control? Exactly. The yeah, fun are... we're looking at uh, fungicide efficacy and then fungicide timing and fungicide okay. placement. And we're also looking at uh, insect insect control. Are you familiar with? Well, um, uh, I, I haven't planted potatoes, but I want to plant potatoes so I could dig those potatoes up and give them as alternative feed the cattle. Oh, okay. So, so that that's where I, I'm. But um, uh, my 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 friend's doing it down in Colorado, and he's getting a heck of a thing. He, I think he's doing real well because the potatoes. So the cattle Such. like to eat it, okay? Oh, yeah. I've heard that too here. Um, so, you know, um, uh, 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 and then he's he's got analysis of a, you know certain potatoes, and then um, he wants to know how to read the analysis for that potato so we could market potatoes and do something like that. Oh, so he wants to do a feed analysis? So, on yeah. The well, well, he already did. He already uh -huh. did that, but yet um, he's trying he's trying to look look somebody to explain everything to him, to help, help him do his business, you know. Um, you mean explain between the different varieties? Well, yeah, different varieties, and then also, um, uh, uh, if he's got this value over here, then he can go to these feedlots or dairies and market them that way. Oh, okay. So, um, you know, first things first, you gotta have, you gotta have producing potatoes first, but then after that, you gotta, you got to know where you're going with the potatoes, you know. Yeah, I've never run the numbers. It seems like you know, potatoes are fairly expensive crop to produce. So we'll get, I don't know, here we get between 250, 300 sack of acre of potatoes, okay. you know, 100 pound sack. So I don't know what that equates to in terms of feed value. That's okay. the numbers and, and, and you have and to And you know what, I, I've, done, I've done some experiment myself, um, not the experiment, but um, uh, trying to uh, Know know what what potatoes have, and that I think it's like at eighty percent um, water, seventy percent, right. five percent water. Right, a lot of um, water. A lot of water. So if, if if I grow them here, and I and I live in Veteran, it's about oh, eight miles, ten miles. Mm -hmm. See, everything would cost so transport. much to transport. So what I, I'm I'm at a a, a loss because. Uh, I can't afford all the all the nice hay, you know. Everybody, right. Everybody's buying nice hay. To average hay is bringing two sixty right now, average. So I, I'm looking for more alternative feed 